Hey, my name is Maxim and in this video I'm going to show you how to properly type your event handlers when you use React with TypeScript. Sometimes when you write React and TypeScript code, you have to define event handlers. And for those event handlers, you have to define the type of the event you're going to be handling. But how do you know what is the event type? So I have three tips for you how to get this uh, event type. First one is to rely on TypeScript type inference. What does it mean? For example, here, instead of defining the handle text change function separately, we could first try to define an inline function. Doesn't have to do anything. We just want to see how would TypeScript type this uh, event object. Event, and then we check the type. As you can see, it's react change event HTML input element. Sounds about right. Now we can undo our changes and type, and type our event. Change event. I'm going to import it from React. And then we pass the type property HTML input element. Another option would be to go to React index.dts file, the type definition file for React. We can go there either by pressing command click on our change event or opening node modules at types react index dts. And here you can find the list of all the event types defined for React. All of those event types accept the type property for the element for which we are handling the event. In this file, you can also find all the element types. For example, HTML, input, element. And here you can see the list of all the HTML elements defined for the TypeScript. And of course, you can refer to React documentation where you can see the list of all the supported event types. For example, form events, mouse events or keyboard events. Thank you for watching, press the like button, subscribe to the channel and join my Discord server. The link will be in the description.